listen to God rather than people. Acts chapter 4 and verse 19. But Peter and John replied, Which is right in God's eyes, to listen to you or to him? You be the judges. Peter and John had hard times with the Pharisees and the synagogue rulers. They were challenging them both for the miracle of the healing of the lame man. They warned them not to speak about the name of Jesus any further. Peter and John refuted such an idea and told them they could not keep quiet about what they have seen and heard. It was their bound duty to build lives of people and that was what Jesus taught them to do. They were open to declare that they prefer to do that which was right in the sight of God than please men and live. They wanted the people in Sanhedrin to be their judges of their actions. The disciples were executing what they heard Jesus teach them. They listened to God and did that which pleased God. The question to us is this, are we listening to Jesus and his teachings or are we hearing it? If we hear, we may not do anything about it. However, if we intently listen, we will become intentional about it. All we need to do is learn to listen to God. Listening is paying attention to what is said and applying it to our personal life. Examining our life against the teachings of Christ Jesus. If we consciously do it, our lives will be pleasing to God. We will have the approval of God. Often we look for approval from people. Peter and John has given us a lesson for our sensible living. Listen to God rather than people. Amen.